He is a man anointed of God to set the captives free. Introducing Apostle Dr. Jones of Wattang, a man called to the body of Christ and specially anointed to set the captives free. I've seen believers that have been born again for 20 years who don't have a child. Making deliverance simple and accessible to all with undeniable testimonies, signs, and wonders following. And now, at this hour of deliverance, let's receive this dynamic ministry of Reverend Dada Boateng of Deliverance Outreach Ministry. Hallelujah, my dear viewer, this hour of deliverance. My name is Pastor Jones, that is watching from Deliverance Outreach Ministry. My prayer is that God will touch you and God will bless you. Whatever you are going through, my God, will deliver you, prosper you, empower you, and lead you into your life of prosperity and abundance and special grace in Jesus' mighty name. Today, I'm speaking to you about the tragedy of polluted blood. When we, when we talk about the mystery of blood, as we are going to talk here, we are not talking about only the blood of Jesus. Though the blood of Jesus is the ultimate but what brought the blood of Jesus to us is that our blood was contaminated. And that's what we are going to talk about. And please, I want you to listen to me. My mobile phone is here. Um, I want you to take your telephone number, take your telephone and call me on this number, 0207-923-2549. 0207-923-2549. And send me text message only on my mobile phone 07950701853 let me repeat it again 07950701853 please what i'm speaking today is very very important because no body can steal from you until they are in you in spiritual realm or in physical world when a murder happened or when a burglary happened the first people they are they they arrest them, interview them, interview them is the people that live in the house. The first person I remember, somebody came to my house and beggar it, and I called the police. They came and and find that everything was okay. The next day, one policeman came to the house and put some black substance on the house. And the first thing the woman did was that the woman police called me, Mr. Boati, I need you here. I went there. He said, you are the first person I'm, arrest I'm arresting you. I said, why? He said, because we want to eliminate you from our inquiries. I need your fingerprint here. I said, I have, I have report. He said, yes, that's our, <laughs> our normal procedure. So I have to sit down there to do 10 fingerprints, to do everything for me to be eliminated from their inquiries. Why is it that? Because the person that is inside is the person that can steal from you, kill you, and destroy you. Nobody from outside know where your glory is. And that's why the Bible said it very, very well. I want us to go to the quotation here, which is very, very dear to God's heart. This is a very powerful quotation. In the book of Jeremiah, in the book of Jeremiah, chapter 16, in the book of Jeremiah, chapter 16, and, 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 now let me read this one first. Ezekiah. Ezekiah chapter 16. If you read chapter 16, the verse 6, the Bible said, And when I passed by thee, and I saw thee polluted in thy own blood, I said unto you, Leave. I said, Leave. <laughs> Did you hear that? When God said, When he passed on us, when he passed through us, and he saw that now one of the things i want to say here quickly is that god created man in his own image that man was is a spirit and god make a body so that you can live on this earth that's why it is illegal for a spirit to live on this earth without a body the moment you lose this body the spirit must go home that's why satan Anytime Satan mess up, you have every power to send him away. Hallelujah. I want you to call me on my, my, 
mobile phone uh, uh, the o seven number quickly hear this any time any enemy disturb you sometimes hear this just take your best educate and tell the devil who is your mother bible said it was therefore necessary for jesus to allow himself to be born of a woman it was therefore necessary so god took the spirit he has made and put the spirit in the blood and put the blood inside your body anytime a blood is contaminated the spirit is contaminated anytime a blood is contaminated the spirit is contaminated whatever enter you you are in a house your spirit live in a house so whatever enter you has ability to destroy you that is why your blood is very very important when i pass by you i saw that you are contaminated it is so disheartening to see a man who is supposed to be a professor in academic but that man is wasting away in a mental home it is so disheartening to see a glorious woman the doctor said there's nothing wrong with the womb the doctor said there's nothing wrong with the husband's pants but they have married for 20 years they can't have a baby they sleep every day whatever enter your house determine what happened in the house i want you to hear me hallelujah thank you jesus look at the verse 22 the same jeremiah 16 and in thy abomination and thy hodrum what is a hodrum a hodrum is witchcraft thou hast not remember the day of thy youth when thou was naked and bare and was polluted in the blood you are in the blood your spirit live in the blood the house of 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 your spirit is the blood now hear this in the book of matthew jesus blow it up matthew chapter 12 hear this matthew chapter 12 verse 33 now let me read from verse 26 coming he said jesus cast somebody who have a demon and okay let me read it from verse 22 then was brought unto him one that possessed with the devil blind dumb and he was healed in so much that the blind and the dumb both speak and they saw and all the people were amazed and said is this the son of david and when the pharisees heard it they said this fellow does not cast out the devil but by belzebu the prince of the devil mm. and when jesus heard it he said every kingdom divided against itself cannot stand so jesus cast demon from a person now look at what jesus said it jesus said in verse 29 or else how can one enter into a strong man house that means the house of the spirit is the body of a human being the house of your spirit is your blood and your blood is in your body that's why when you lose your blood you die jesus said or else how can one enter into a strong man house now look at the verse 43 <laughs> In the verse 43 jesus said when an unclean spirit is gone out of a man he walked through dry places seeking rest and finding none then he said i will return to my house where i came from so the evil spirit and the good spirit their house is your body <laughs> now in your body where they live is your blood and the moment your blood is polluted the presence of god the zoe life the spirit of god the power of god what make you to be acceptable to both the spirit world and the physical world when it departs from you you live a life of rejection and that's why you see people that are divinely destined to be a groundbreaking in academic wasting away in a mental home are you listening to me that's why you see people that is empowered to be businessmen businesswomen but whatever they touch died 
There's nothing wrong with them. Something has entered them and has polluted their blood. When the blood is polluted, a man cannot think right because somebody controls your mind. In fact, in the book of Mark, let me read this book of Mark to you before I tell you something. In the book of Mark chapter 5, Bible say, and they came over to the other side of the sea into the country of Gadara. And when they came out of the ship, immediately they met him out of the tomb, a man with an unclean spirit who had his dwelling in the tomb. Did you hear that? Now, Bible said, the man cried loud day and night. And Jesus said, come out of him, that unclean spirit. And Jesus asked him, what is your name? And he said, we are legion. Legion comprised over between 6,000 to 10,000 military soldiers of that time, the Roman legion. So inside a man's body, carried spirits. <laughs> when those spirits entered to 2,000 pigs, the 2,000 pigs couldn't stand. They ran into the water. That's how violent you see those spirits are. And all these spirits were inside a man's body. That's why I'm saying that tragedy of polluted blood. Without blood, a spirit cannot live. The house of the blood, the, the house of the spirit is the blood. So that is why spirits are always seeking for blood. If you read the Bible, you know that blood appeared in the Bible more than 700 times. That's how important you know that blood is to the spirit world. But me and you, the advantage we have is that we don't need the blood of goats and bulls and cows and cats and pigeons again. No. God, through the blood of Jesus, God has brought the blood of Jesus. Because when you read from the beginning, who initiates the, 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 the redemption of man? A, a dead man don't know what is happening. When Adam sinned, Bible said, God said to Adam that the day that you sin, thou shalt die. The day Adam sinned, Adam died. So a dead man don't know how to help himself. A dead man can't cover himself. A dead man cannot move himself to a mortuary. It was God that came down and said, Adam, where are thou? Because Adam was not living. Adam was dead. And God spoke to Adam. And God came to Adam, a dead man. And God so killed animal. Who did the terror? It was God. Who killed the animal? It was God. Everything for man redemption was God. That's why it was a prototype of God bringing Jesus Christ to this earth to kill Jesus. To pour his blood upon the Holy of Holies. Upon the altar of God. The mercy seat. For man to receive mercy from God Almighty. You have no hand in your redemption. God did it all. You have nothing to do with it. It was God. Now, now, hear this. Take your telephone and call me now. I want to talk to you one minute. How can the blood inside me be polluted? Pastor, what do you need by what do you mean by polluted blood? Because if you read the Bible, it's all there. It's all there. Hear this. In the book of Ezekiel chapter 14 verse 11. That the house of Israel may go no more astray from me. Neither be polluted anymore with their transgression. The moment they transgress, they are polluted. So how can a blood inside me be polluted? Because the moment your blood is polluted... Your spirit is polluted. The moment your blood is polluted, hear me, your spirit is polluted. So how can your blood be polluted? Hear me. As I'm talking now, if what I'm saying is part of you, call me quickly, let me pray for you. Don't sit down one day and die. There's hope for you. Jesus said something. Satan does nothing to steal, to kill, and to destroy. When Adam took the fruit and ate it, and the fruit enter him because it enter into his blood and every mankind come from adam everybody was seen like adam you were not there when your fathers worship idols but everything they did you are part of it 
I was in Ghana about five years ago. I was preaching. And I met this dear young lady about 48 years. All the brothers have died. The father married so many women. And none of the daughters are, have married. When I met the girl, she was 48 years. And the girl came with anger that the father is a witch. Everywhere she goes, they say the father is a witch. I say, I'm not the pastor that say those things. But one thing I want to tell you is that, girl, don't tell that your father is a witch. You say, daddy, I know what I'm saying. <coughs> the man came. The man was an elder of a church. So we started praying. And it was true the man is, was not a witch. But what happened? During 1957, that's why the, the, the man, after we finished praying, that's what the man was telling me. He came to the pastor that I, I, I went to and said, your pastor you brought from London has killed me. And the pastor said, oh, you're dying. what did he do to you? He said, in 1957, I went to a witch doctor and they gave me three mystery stones. In Ghana, they call it a crab war. And he said, I swallow it. The thing was that I will not die until I am 120 years. But none of my seed, none of my seed will cross the border of 40 years. And none of my daughters will marry. And all the sons died at the age of 35, 36, 37, 38. Has lost all the children. The children didn't swallow it. It was the father that swallowed it. But it entered into the father's bloodline. And the father's blood was polluted with death. And death transfer, translate, transmit into the children. And all of them died. I don't see one of the first, see, see, hear this. How can a blood be polluted? Number one, whatever you swallow or you eat from a witch doctor, from satanic agent, from a witch, from a wizard, anything you eat or you swallow from any evil altar, it contaminates, it pollutes, it disturbs, it destroys the spirit man inside you. And not only you, it translates into the successive generation. That is why the Bible said, Abraham in Genesis chapter 12, he said, he said, he said, hear, hear this. He said, in you shall all the families of this earth be blessed. If I can make you bless, all the families are blessed. If you are cursed, the following generation is cursed. What enter you flow to them? In our language, in English language, there's a word they call descendants. Something is descending from them to you. You understand what I'm saying? I want you to capture this. Hallelujah. The first one, have you ever gone to a witch doctor? Did they give you something to eat? Did they give you something to drink? What did you drink? What did you eat? What a, a man came to our church. Sorry to say this, the man died about six years ago. When he came, his eye was as yellow as my clothes, yellow. I asked him, what happened? He said, Daddy, I can't sleep. I used to go to Togo, Togo. Ghana people know what I'm saying. To go and bring things. And somebody took me to a place. Call it, uh, um, I have forgot this. this ay, 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 ay. There's, a, there's a town uh, uh, oh, in, in that area. And I forget the name just now. And somebody took me to a doctor. And they gave me some yellowish concussion. And I drank it. Are you listening to me? And after about 20 years, what the man drank has killed him. So many people's sicknesses, many people's pain, many people what they are going through is based on what has entered them. Please call me quickly. Have you ever gone to a witch doctor they gave you something to drink? Have you ever gone to a witch doctor? They give you a black substance to eat. A man said to me that they put a black substance in Ghana, they call it a motto, into the hands, a, like a black powder. And the man spoke certain ways. And he said, Don't close your eye. In, in the eye, on the eye, opening eye, the black substance swallow, the hands swallow the black substance into his body. They, sometimes they gave you, they say, Eat it, you eat it. Sometimes they mix it with hot drinks and they say drink it and you drank it. Sometimes they give it to you through a chewing stick. They say chew all this stick and swallow it and you chew it and swallow it. Please call the number quickly. 
Number two, anybody that has had incisions in your body, anybody that you go to a witch doctor, a native doctor, your father, your mother, they caught you because you were sick, because when you were a baby, you have convulsion, because something happened to you, because you were looking for solution, and you went there, they gave you incisions. When I, see, hear this, after every incision, they put something inside the wounds and they massage it until the teeth enter it. I know what I'm telling you. I have incision before. They massage it until the blood substance enter your body. And the moment that thing is done, your life is hindered. A spirit enter your blood. It pollutes your blood. And a polluted blood, you can't go anywhere. The spirit is there to steal from you. I used to say, this is very, very important. Please call me. I'm watching you. You went to a place. They gave you an incision. They gave you on your chest. And since then, everything is gone from your life. Call me quickly. I want to pray for you. Number one is the thing you eat, the thing you swallow. Number two is the incision they gave to you. Number three is through your dreams. Many people's blood has been contaminated by their dreams. You see yourself eating in the dream. It's contamination. You see yourself having sex in the dream. It's contaminations. You see yourself, uh, 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 that animal has bite you. It's contaminations. It's pollution in the blood. You see something like a snake bite you. A dog bite you. Are you listening to me? You see yourself swallowing tablets in the dream. You see yourself being injected in the dream. All these things contaminate and pollute our blood. Please, I don't know you. You saw yourself eating a dream. Call the number quickly. I want to pray for you. You saw yourself in the dream being injected. Call the number quickly. You saw yourself in a dream. A cat, a snake, a dog bite you. Call the number quickly. I want to pray for you. I pray for somebody. That dream that a dog came and bite you. Any poison that has been released into your bloodstream, into your system, that has a, a reflect as sickness. Today, I release you. I cast it out in the name of Jesus. By the power of the Holy Ghost, I release you now. Call the number quickly. You see my number there. 0207 923 2549. 0207 923 2549. 07950-701-85 07950-701-853 Please call the number quickly. I want to pray for you. Send me also your text message. Do it quick now. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Contamination. 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 I, what is your dream? Have you ever dream you see somebody shooting you? Should you pay the bullet that enter you pollute your blood? I want to pray for you. Please. Hallelujah. The first one is the food and the drink we eat from witch doctors. Satanic agents. Number two is the incisions. Number three is the dreams. The dream stage. Then number four is very, very important. Have you ever gone to a place they buff you with concussion? They buff you with blood. They took you to a river and they buff you for, for ritual. If you go to a river and you buff, there's nothing wrong with it. But when a witch doctor took you there and do a ritual bath for you, there's something wrong. Because in your body, there, there are pores that open and breathe. So anything that enters you, enter into your body. And when that thing entered your body, it contaminates your blood. When Jesus went to an agony in the Garden of Gethsemane, the Bible said that pearls opened and the sweat became blood. The same way sweat comes, so also another thing can enter there. So maybe they took you when you were a child into a shrine and they bath you there. Sometimes they gave you the thing to your house and you use it to bath. Please call the number I want to pray for you. I pray that may Holy Ghost enter you. And nullify all this evil in Jesus' name. I pray that the Spirit of God will enter you. To nullify whatever has entered you in the name of Jesus. I pray that the Spirit of God will enter you. 
and nullify everything in Jesus' name. Number five. How does a man's blood contaminated? How can it be contaminated? Number, number five. Whenever you go to any satanic agent, any witch doctor, any native doctor, and they gave you a cloth, a ring, a token, a totem, an item, when a demonic item come in contact with your body, it releases the spirit from that altar to enter you. Maybe you are watching me now. God said I should say this thing to you. You went to a place, they gave you a ring. You wear. This is not your husband. <laughs> this is not an engagement ring. From a witch doctor. They have given you a ring before. You put it in your hand. It means that your spirit man has been married to that altar. Call me quickly. Let, maybe you have removed the ring. You have thrown it away. But we have not renounced the spirit behind it. That's why every time you see a spirit having sex with you, call the animal quickly. I want to pray for you. Call me quickly. I want to pray for you. Maybe you've gone to a place. They gave you a cloth. You wear it. Maybe you went to a place. They give you something. Bring this. They took your clothes. They make incantation on it. And they say, go and wear it. They took your pants. They took your bra. They make incantation. They took your husband's pants. They took your husband's shirt. Because you were looking for solution. I'm not blaming you. But it's affecting you and we must break it. Any item you took from the sign, a young girl came to our church and the girl was talking. Nothing was happening. Everything about him, about her was gone. Why? She went to a wee doctor shrine and the wee doctor, the, she was traveling and the wee doctor said, okay, open your mouth. The girl opened the mouth and the wee doctor plugged the head. Choop. And the girl, open your mouth and he put it and the girl swallowed it. And the man also plugged the head and I plugged the girl here and she swallowed it. He swallowed it. He said, go, my spirit will protect you. And wherever the girl is going, her life becomes useless. Something begins to follow this girl. I'm, I'm watching you now. God is telling me, you went to a place. They gave you a cola nut and you chew it. There's somebody you are watching now. You went to a place and they took your clothes. They took your hair. They took your fingernail. Call quickly, I want to pray for you. Number seventh one I want to say here before I tell you the effect is what you take from the body of satanic agents. A lady was telling me this thing that they were doing a festival in their, in their, in their, in their, in their tribe. And this witch doctor came and took his manhood in presence of everybody and urinated on the soup. And they stir it, and the whole people, they drink it. <laughs> you, see, you see, the wee doctor is dancing and sweating. The wee doctor will remove the sweat and throw it on people, and throw it on people. The wee doctor will take water and put it on herself or herself and get to the ground, and people dig the ground and begin to use that soil and begin to use that water that came from the person. The wee doctor will use a handkerchief, wipe himself, and give it to you. See, all this thing is fluid. Then when it comes in contact with you, a spirit enter you. You understand what I'm saying? I want to pray for you. What are the effects of this? What are the effects of this? There's an effect of this. Number one, one of the effects of this polluted blood is that it allowed a spirit to move inside your body. That's why many people, they see things moving in their body. It is the spirit that has entered their blood. That when the blood is circulating, they also are circulating. You are, you are watching me now. Things, you feel things moving in your body. You see hand touching your body. You see things touching you. Please call the number one to pray for you. Sometimes it looks like your body is not there. A man came here, she, he said to us that they have given the head incision and every day things are moving in his head. He felt that this is sometimes he wants to hit the head. It took deliverance for her to be free. A lady came here, has cough and cough and cough and cough. Are you listening to me? Not knowing that there is a fly inside her. A lady came to our church. I've shared this testimony several times. Saw a serpent enter her private part in the dream. Are you listening to me? And when we pray, the spirit of snake came out to life. She took the picture and sent it to me. 
So whenever you see things moving in your body, who sent them there? I'm asking you a question. Who sent them there? Please hear me. I don't know who you are. I'm talking to you. Have you ever seen things moving in your body? Please call the number quickly. I want to pray for you. When you are sleeping, you see him touching you. The next one is very important. When a blood is contaminated, you begin to hear voices. You begin to hear what? Voices. Inside you, things begin to talk. You are a fool. A lady was talking to me that the spirit that is speaking in her is saying that she will never make it. You are a silly girl. The spirit begins to mock her. The spirit begins to mock her. I don't know what is mocking your destiny. I release you from that crunch in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Today you are happy. Tomorrow you are angry. When you are, you are going, you felt that things are fooling you. You felt that things are moving uh, uh, with you. You felt that somebody is talking against you. In your mind, today you are happy. Today you are smiling. And tomorrow you are in the mood. You sat down. You don't want to talk to anybody. Are, are you listening to me? A man was talking to me. Uh, say, Daddy, my wife is a good woman. But when my wife enters into that shell, nobody can talk to her. Please call this time. I want to talk with you. I want to pray for you. By the altar of God. By the power of the Holy Ghost. By the anointing of God. By the finger of God. Every authoritative power inside your blood. Pushing you. Speaking inside your, your mind. Speaking through your blood. They are cursed in the name of Jesus. In Mark chapter 5. When, verse 6. When Jesus asked the man that question. The spirit answered it. He said we are legion. The spirit in the man's blood was talking. We are legion. <laughs> so, he who is in you speak for you. Number three, one of the effects of polluted blood is you live a life of rejection. Wherever you go and people accept you, within short time, they reject you. Because you are not yourself. Many people have not even touched their destiny. Sometimes it is disheartening to see beautiful girl that's supposed to marry but can't stay with a man for three months. They do everything they have to do to the man but the man don't appreciate them. You see a beautiful girl, you are more beautiful than what your husband is chasing but your husband don't see eye to eye with you. Your children even don't see eye to eye with you. Why? Something is in you and it is driving you because in Mark chapter 2, in Mark chapter 2, verse 10, he said, verse, verse 12, 10 to 12, he said, the spirit entered him and driven him. What enter you is what drives you. Until a man enter a car, the car can't drive by itself. No airplane can fly by itself. It doesn't matter how beautiful, how powerful the engine is. Until man enter the airplane and start it and move, it can't fly. When you see men flying, something has entered them. When you see men coming down, something has entered them. Hallelujah. You are living a rejected life. You do good to people. People don't respond to you good. They respond to you bad. Don't blame them. I want you to call them. I want to pray for you. There's going to be a turning point. There's going to be a change. There's going to be a turning point. There's going to be a change. Please don't hesitate. Take the number quickly. I want you to call me. I want to speak to you. One minute before I continue. Maybe you are going through what I'm telling you. What I'm saying. You are going through evil dream. You are going through rejection. You are hearing voices. Things are telling you you can't make it in life. Things are mocking against you at your destiny. You are going through frustration. Please hear this. Every Tuesdays, every Wednesdays, every Fridays from 4 o'clock, I sit down and do one-to-one -one counseling. I want to sit and talk with you. Nothing destroys man than ignorance. What you don't know, senior you. There is something I know you don't know. There's something you know I don't know. I want to sit down and share. Let us come. That's why the Bible called it communion. That's why the Bible said, don't stop meeting one another. I want to talk with you. Come, let us sit down and communicate. Let us sit down and talk. And then when we sit down and talk, we'll get the best out of everybody. Hallelujah. Every Tuesdays, every Wednesdays, every Fridays, I sit there and I talk to people. Why are you going through rejection? 
One of the things that happen when a spirit, when your spirit man is polluted, when your blood is polluted, is you go through miscarriages, physical miscarriages, financial miscarriages, bodily miscarriages, marriage miscarriages. You marry all right, but you miscarriage. You get pregnant all right, but you miscarriage. Two sisters came into our church here. Are you listening to me? One has 17 miscarriages. One has 14 miscarriages. Why? Another lady came all the way from Luton. Get pregnant to eight months. And someone will come and sleep with her. And the baby die in the womb. It is not her. There is something inside her that is causing this to happen. You go through miscarriages. One of the effects of this evil is what I call setbacks, retrogression, and disappointment. Setbacks, retrogressions, and disappointment. Setbacks, retrogression, and disappointment. One of the things that I hate more is addicted to habits, evil habits. You see people, they don't want to drink, but the spirit in them drives them. They will tell them, if you smoke one, you are finished. But the spirit will drove her, and before you know, she's smoking. Before you know, he's smoking. They don't want what they are doing, but they can't control themselves. Because there's a magnetic pull in them that push them, pull them to do what they don't were supposed to do. I break it from you in the name of Jesus. I release you in the name of Jesus. Any demonic spirit in your body making you to be addicted to what you don't want. Today, I command them to come out of you in the name of Jesus. I command that spirit of addiction addicted to nicotine, addicted to drugs, addicted to drinking, whatever you're addicted to, addicted to sex, I command you in the name of Jesus, come out, that spirit, that foul demon. Thank you, Jesus. Addicted. Hallelujah. The last one I want to talk to you quickly is when this spirit is operating in a man, you go through anxiety. You go through worried. You go through sorrowful life. You live a life of sadness. You live a life of unhappy. It doesn't matter what people do to you. You feel sorrowful. You are not happy in life. They say that if I marry, I'll be happy. They marry, they are not happy. They said if I go here, I'll be happy. They go there, they are not happy. If I have a baby, I'll be happy. They have the baby, they are still crying. In life, they live a life of sorrowful bitterness. Hallelujah. Many undiagnosed incurable diseases come from this contamination. Hallelujah. You see people that are born great, but they are living backwards. It's not them. You know, it's not them. Hallelujah. I'm talking to you. One of the effects of this polluted uh, blood is what? Your organs also can be paralyzed through this polluted blood. It can affect your, it can affect you. Growth in your body, fibroids, tumors, all those things. Bible says Jesus was casting demons. We all know, if you read the book of Mark, let me read it to you. In the book of Mark, the Bible says it very clearly. Mark chapter 8. Hallelujah. The book of Mark, Mark chapter 8, Bible said clearly here, he said, in those days, the multitude being very great and having nothing to eat, Jesus called his disciple and said, I have compassion for this multitude. Why are they following Jesus? Because they were all possessed. Most of them were, that's what Jesus said, these people are like, a, 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 a sheep without a shepherd. Now, let me read the Luke chapter 8 accounts to you and it will bless you. Luke chapter 8, verse 2. He said, And certain women who had been healed of evil spirits and infirmities. Did you hear that? Mary called Madeline, of whom seven devils came. Everybody thought that she was sick, but they didn't know that behind the sickness were seven devils. So it can affect your organs. Most sickness, fibroid, menstrual pain, abnormal menstruation, tumors, confusion, 
madness. Are you listening to me? You're hearing voices. Why? There's a spirit in that house. You go through poverty, rejection. Your blessings are being diverted. Instead of you being promoted, they are demoting you. You go through afflictions. Are you listening to me? Your spirit man can be in prison when the blood is polluted. Hallelujah. You see people begin to live cursed life. I want to pray for you. Send me your text message quickly. Call the number you are seeing quickly on the TV. Are you listening to me? One of the effects of this polluted blood is you see sudden spiritual backwardness. You see backsliding. The man is born again, but he don't want to go to church again. You see constant failure. You see financial problems. You see health issues. You see bad health. You see depression. You see mysterious sicknesses. Frustration. You see confusion. You see sudden disaster. You see great losses. You see late marriages. Hatred. Unexplainable financial crunch. Poverty. Unexplainable poverty. You don't know what you have done with your money, but you are crushed. Call the number quickly. I want to pray for you. Hallelujah. Send me your text message and let me speak for you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Pastor, for your message. I thank you very, very much. I also saw myself eating and having sex and always somebody chased me in my dream. Could you pray for me and what advice can you give to me? The advice I can give to you is that take my number and call me. My number is 07950 Call me and come here and I'll agree and pray for you. But I pray for you that anything harassing you, it is canceled in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Um, my children hate me too. I smell a perfume of hatred. Mm. I barely keep a job for two months. Everybody turn against me. Every, even black people like me. Why? Even God own people. Oh. Since I accepted him. Please pray for me. Even dogs backed at me when I pass. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Lord, I pray for this, my wonderful sister. Any demonic powers, satanic spirits that has entered into her blood, making people to reject her, making her to live a life of rejection, by the blood of Jesus, I declare you are free forever. Hallelujah. Please say, pray for me. My name is Usaratin. Anything that is not of God, pray for me, say. Let God take it out of my life and pray for my brother that, that just came, come, comes here. Now he's looking for documents and for job. His name is Henry. Lord, I pray for you. I pray for your brother that may the land of Italy accept you. May God bless you. May God impact, bless over you. Anything that is harassing you, I declare it is canceled. And may God reward you with blessings. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hallelujah. Pastor, please pray for me. I've been studying at university for the past eight years. I start and stop halfway. Um, I, uh, I, have, I start and stop halfway. Something is happening again into my life. May God bless you and pray for me. I pray that God this time will make you and help you for you to accomplish it. You will not stop and start again. The blessing that made great is coming on you. The curse of stagnation, it is broken. The curse of backwardness, it is broken. Today, receive power to prosper. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hallelujah. Right, this one is very, very long. Good day, sir. I'm going through financial problems. I'm going through a rejection. I also dream seeing somebody sleeping with me. I see dogs, dead people, and last week I saw somebody stabbing me. 
and sometimes i get confused and i felt that i want to cry please could you agree with me i'm also going through late marriage i am 44 years no marriage no child and i feel worried lord i pray for my sister whatever is making you to go through this worried i declare it is cancelled in jesus name may god bless you hallelujah please pray for me pray for me and my traveling companion planning mission trip to cuba we experienced a bad demonic attack may god bless you reverend i pray for you my brother may god take you and bring you safety may god release you from every demonic attack i invoke the blood of jesus to cover you i cover your friend as well may you go and come back normal free from every demonic oppression and physical oppression in jesus mighty name amen thank you jesus hallelujah um, hello my name is elizabeth please could you pray for me i can't remember my dreams and also i feel some resistance in my mind and my body when i went to meditate on the word of god i am 49 years and i'm not married and have not married before i have a dream sleeping with people i pray that any spirit that has married you confusing you in marriage depressing you distressing you in marriage by the blood of jesus i declare you are free forever from today you will never be delayed again go and marry in jesus name amen thank you jesus how are you man of god glory glory be to god for your life and your family please pray for me concerning school application for my son my marriage and my documents god bless you my dear i pray for you in the name of jesus may god bless your school may god bless your son may god bless your marriage may god make you to progress in life in jesus name amen please pray for me for failure at the verge of success and snail progress <laughs> snail progress and pray for me and my wife as well she dreamt last week and woke up from her sleep and she saw scratches and once upon a time she always she also dreams and saw herself crying and she woke up with tears it's not a good dream at all i don't like a dream that you see and you are crying it's not good i pray for you that tears is cancelled everything that will bring tears to your eye it is cancelled anything that will make you to cry it is cancelled by the blood of jesus my dear brother i pray for you i pray for your wife anything that will make you to weep in life it is cancelled may god bless you pastor please pray for me i i do see snail and tortoise in my dream and things has been very slow in my life though out of this i'm prayed please could you pray deliverance prayer for me listen to me if you need a deliverance come and see me I'm, i can pray for you i'm going to pray for you now but when you come to our church we have a form that we fill and we take time with you at least everybody that comes here we take like 20 minutes or 30 minutes with them go through the forms renounce it and break certain things from them and you love it when you come and see me you hear me i have time with everybody and i pray for you in jesus name any dream you saw tortoise you saw snakes that have been disturbing you i declare it is cancelled hi pastor my name is la larissa flip i am deaf i could i could like you to pray for me and my kids foster in foster care uh, we are going to court in december to fight for them for them to be released to me and pray again for stress free and happiness i'm under stress oh larissa i pray for you in the name of jesus christ may go as you are listening to me now you are receiving your healing by the power in the name of jesus receive your healing now hallelujah pastor please pray for me i have liver the doctor said i have liver problems and every day i'm sick i'm not well at all could you agree and pray for total healing in my body i pray for you by the power of the holy ghost receive your healing now there's somebody you are watching me now you are going through certain movement in your body things are moving in your body 
and it's disturbing you, please call the number quickly. I want to pray for you. There's another person you're also watching me now. Always you go through headache, pain. It's like sometimes your forehead is coming out. You are going through severe migraine. I want you to call me and I want to pray for you. There's a lady you are watching me now. I don't know whether it, was, it is you or your daughter. One of you, you are going through severe menstrual pain, abnormal menstruation, menstrual overflow. You are going through these three things. One of these three things that I'm saying, call the number quickly. I want to pray for you. Call the number quickly. God is stopping you now. There's a man, you are going through low sperm count and it's disturbing you. Your wife is looking for baby and you are going through low sperm count and it is disturbing you. Please call the number, I want to pray for you. Call the number quickly. By the power of the Holy Ghost, by the anointing of God. Call it now. Call it, call it now. Call it now. Hallelujah. Please, pastor, could you pray for me? Um, someone... Some time ago, someone slept with me. And now the doctor said I have HIV. Someone slept with me in the dream. Some time ago, someone slept with me in the dream. And now the doctor said I have HIV. Did you hear what I'm saying? Polluted blood. I release you in the name of Jesus. I cancel this HIV system. I break it from you. From today you are free. From today you are free. From today you are free forever. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Please call me on the mobile phone, uh, house number. Let me, let me finish the last one. Hallelujah. This one, I, I don't know what the person is asking. He's asking about equitation. Uh, dear pastor, I always see black bird flying behind me. And I see images like nail following me. And I am seriously in debt and I'm afraid that I will die. My dear brother or my dear sister, I don't know who you are, but you are not going to die. By the blood of Jesus, I declare you are healed. I release you in the name of Jesus. By the authority God has given to me as a man of God, I release you in the name of Jesus. I pray for you that every hand of the devil against you, following you, it is canceled forever. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hear this. My time is up. I want to stop here, but I want to give you this book. I'm preaching from this, my book here. Unveiling the Mystery of Monitoring Spirit. I want to give you this book. It's one of the most powerful books you will ever read. It will help you. And I want to add this book to it. And I want to add another one to it. And I want to add this one to it. Four books. If you can help me from 20 pounds or more, I'll give you these books. Please, I want you to help us. We want to come on the TV every day. We want to come every day. It's very, very important. People are dying. People are going through pain. Just now, I came here within one hour. I have almost 700 um, messages. That's how you see people are desperate. And I want to take this and talk with you. Please, don't sit down and die. Every Tuesdays, every Wednesdays, every Friday, I sit down and I talk to people one to one. Nothing destroys a man than ignorance. Come and see me. It doesn't matter the church you go. You can go to apostolic. You can go to church of England. You can go to a Catholic church. You can go to a Pentecost. You can go to a Sambis of God. Wherever church you are, this is a house of deliverance. Just come. Let's pray for you. You go back to your church. Many pastors come here. I have pastor friend, pastor Placet. I, 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 I always come here with apostle Charles Mate. He has his church, Global Impact Ministry. But he come with me. Sometimes you see me with Pastor Jonathan, Pastor Zubike, Pastor uh, Mama they will send the husband. Many, many pastors, they come to our church for impartation and then we all pray, enjoy it, the blessing, and we go. My producer that produced all our, our, our TV uh, videos and all those things, he's a minister, he has his church, but he comes with us, we do things together. But I would say, come, let us reason together. So maybe you are a pastor, you are going through frustration. People don't come to your church. It doesn't matter what you do. I met a man for 20 years. His church members are not five people. But when he come in contact with me, we start praying. Go and see the church now. Within two years, he has more than 60 people. Come, let us reason together. We, we will push that devil away. And your destiny will explode. You're a business person, but everything you touch died. I want you to fight them and come. Don't sit down and die. You felt things moving in your mind. You felt things talking with you. Are you listening to me? You, or you are going through demonic dreams. Please don't sit down and die. 
I want you to call the number. Don't forget, Bishop Chukudu is coming. Our spiritual father will be here for December conference. I want to invite you, please. If you are coming from outside England, call us quickly. Let us find some place for you. You don't need to rent a house. You don't need to eat. We have a car. We have a house. We have, the church has rented five bedroom houses for you to come and sleep there for free of charge. We want to help you. God send me that. Go and preach deliverance to the people. Wherever you see my people sharing tears, go and wipe it. God spoke to me. That's why I'm doing what I'm doing. I want you to come. Make yourself available. And you see the wonders of God. There is somebody you are watching me. You are going through migration crisis. Call the number quickly. Let me pray for you. There's another person you are, you are watching me now. Your firstborn has become so vagabond and so difficult and stubborn that you don't know what to do. Please call the number. I want to talk with you. I want to pray with you. Call it now. Call it now. There's a woman. You are between 35 to 40. You are watching me now. Men come to you, they don't stay with you, they don't marry you, they just abuse you and go. Call, that case is being broken now in Jesus' name. Don't forget, don't forget we have an apps on the, on, on, on the, on the or I, I've seen the apps now. As TV, as TV, A-C-T-S TV. Go there, you get uh, our radio, you get our TV on the internet and watch it. May God bless you, may God empower you, may God lift you on high, may generation more hear your exploit. May heaven above heaven read the blessing of god over you you are blessed and highly favored in jesus name pastor john said god bless you bye 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 you bye bye he is a man anointed of god to set the captives free introducing apostle dr jones daughter boatang a man called to the body of christ and specially anointed to set the captives free. I've seen believers that have been born again for 20 years who don't have a child. Making deliverance simple and accessible to all with undeniable testimonies, signs, and wonders following. And now, at this hour of deliverance, let's receive this dynamic ministry of Reverend Donna Boateng. Deliverance Outreach Ministry. Hallelujah, my dear viewer. This is the hour of deliverance. My name is Pastor Jones Daddy Boati from Deliverance Outreach Ministry in London. Here, I'm so pleased to have Apostle Charles Mate with me. We're going to agree, we're going to pray for you, we're going to pray with you, we're going to pray to you. Heaven will shake Amen. on your behalf in Jesus' name. Amen. Apostle Charles, may God bless you. God bless you, sir. In Jesus' Thank name. Thank you for having me. I have this, my wonderful book here. I call it Exposing Mysteries. Yes, sir. Or Mysteries Exposed. And I'm going to preach from this book. Amen. You know, if you don't understand mysteries, you walk in misery. Yeah. I want you to hear me very well. Please, it's very, very important. You need to capture everything I'm going to say. And one thing I want you to do is that get this book. I have 100 prayer points behind it. After understand, because you can't use yesterday revelation no. for today demon. No. The demons has advanced. Yes, sir. That's what you need now revelation. Yeah. Mysteries. Mm. Tragedy of hidden mysteries. Yes, sir. There are certain things that is hidden. And if you, you see, what makes Satan to enter mm. into tragedy mm. of he mm. don't understand mysteries. Mm. He think that he understands mysteries, but mm. he didn't. That's because if you read 1 Corinthians, yes, sir. please read, go to 1 Corinthians. Apostle, are you there? Yeah, the book of 1 Corinthians. 1 Corinthians. Chapter 2. Mm -hmm. Look at the verse 7. 1 Corinthians chapter 2. Mm -hmm. And verse mm. number 7. Yes. But we speak the wisdom of God. We speak the wisdom of God. In a mystery. In a mystery. Even the hidden wisdom. Even the hidden wisdom. Which God ordained before which the world. Which God ordained before the unto world. Unto our glory. Unto our glory. Keep going. Which none of the princes of this world which knew. Which none of the princes of this world know. For had they known it. For if they know it. They would not have crucified the Lord they would of glory. Not. See, if Satan know about the mystery of a seed mm. of a woman. Yes. He wouldn't have touched mm. Jesus. No. Satan know that how can a woman have a seed? Mm. The sperm is in the man. Yes, sir. So women, leave your way.
He did not know that a time is coming. Yes. God will step from eternity to time. Mm. And God will come into a woman's womb. Yes. And he will get flesh. Yes. And come as a God. Yes. And by his blood. Yes. To break me and you free mm. from demonic chains. Mm. So there are mysteries. Yes. That you're supposed to know. Uh. And until you understand mysteries, you walk in satanic misery. Mm. And many people are walking in misery. Mm. Financially, they walk in misery. Yes. Health-wise, they walk in misery. Maritally, they walk in misery. Yes. Everything about their life is, is what? Misery. Mm. They are going through pain. Mm. And please, I want you to open your understanding for me tonight. Yes, sir. Hear this. There is a telephone number on your screen. Mm. I want you to call that number now. 07950-701853-0208-0207-923-2549. Please, mm. I want you to call these two numbers. And I want to agree and pray for you. Yes. Apostle, yes, I'm going to give seven mysteries uh -huh. that Satan used to attack mankind. Mm. Number one, one of the mystery yes, sir. that caused misery to humanity yes, sir. is through our blood. Our blood. If Satan can get into your blood, mm. your children, children, mm. children, forever, mm. you are in trouble. Mm. Mm. Are you listening to me? Please, yes, I want you to hear this. God spoke to Abraham in Genesis chapter 12, verse 3. Mm -hmm. He said, I will bless them that mm -hmm. bless you, mm -hmm. but him that curse, I will curse. Mm -hmm. That means, if I don't protect you, mm -hmm. and anybody make you a curse, mm -hmm. the children that are going to come through you, yes, sir. because in you, I'm going to bring my son, yes, sir. Jesus. Yes, sir. So if I don't protect you, yes, sir. and make somebody make your bloodline a curse, yes, sir. my son will be cursed. Yes, sir. And I'll bless them that I will bless, bless them that bless you. And curse him that and curses curse you. him that curse you. Keep going. And in thee shall in all the you, families of the in earth. In you shall all. So if that's why in Matthew chapter 12, verse 33, yes, he said, either make the tree good mm. and the fruit will be good. Mm. Either make the tree bad mm. and the fruit is bad. Mm. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Either make the tree good. He, he said, he said, not me, you. Yes, sir. You. Yeah. Make your tree good. Yes. Make your body good. Yes, sir. Make your bloodline good. Yes. So that anything that, that comes is going up, through you, yes, sir, will be good. Will be good. Yes, sir. Because yes, sir. he was talking about demon. If you read yes. from verse twenty-two, yes, they brought a boy who was a demon possessed yes, boy, sir. and he cast demons. And people thought that he was using the spirit of Bezalel. We said, yes. no, 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 I'm a clean person. Yes, sir. Because God has made me good. Yes, sir. My tree was good. Yes, sir. Mary womb. There was Mary was a virgin. Yes, sir. Jesus didn't use a second hand thing. Yes, sir. The womb Jesus was born was a brand new yes, tear, tear rubber. The tomb he, he slept in was a brand new. Nobody has slept there before. Yes, sir. Everything Jesus did was brand new. Yeah. His blood was brand new. Yes, sir. The womb was brand new. Yes, sir. Are you seeing the cross was brand new? Yes, sir. Are you seeing the tomb was brand new? Yes, sir. Everything Jesus did, Jesus lived was what? Brand, brand new. new. Yes, sir. No second hand. No. One of the mystery is blood. Is the blood. Anything that enter your blood has power to destroy you mm. or to enhance you. Mm. Jesus took a water yes, sir. and blessed it. Yes, sir. And said, Drink it. Yes, sir. This is my blood. Yes, sir. If you drink it, you have my life. Yes, sir. Go to John 6 53. Mm. John 6 53. Hear me very well. Mm. John 6 53. Please, yes, I want you to hear this. There is a mystery in blood. Mm. One of the most powerful things everybody you are watching me, you have to know that what enter you have power to control you. Uh, are you there? Yes, sir. John, John six, chapter 6, verse 53. Verse number 53. Yes. Then Jesus said then unto Jesus them, Jesus said unto them, Verily, verily, very, verily, I say unto you, I say unto you, Except ye eat the flesh of the Son of the Man, flesh of son of man and, drink his blood, and drink his blood, ye have no life in you. Why? Because John 10, 10 said, The thief comes not them to steal, to kill, and to destroy. Yes, but I have come, yes, that sir. you might have life, and have it more abundant. Mm. If I enter you, I give you life. Mm. If another one enter you, he gave you death. Mm. So how can those spirits enter you? Mm. 
either make the tree good uh -huh. and the fruit to be good yes sir. either make the tree bad yes sir. and the fruit to be bad yes sir. so how can you make your tree good yes sir. what enter you is what enhance you yes sir. this is a tree this is a tree mm -hmm. when you put fertilizer under this tree yes, sir. it will be good yes, sir. when you put hot water under this tree you kill it yes, sir. are you listening to me jesus said two people built a house mm -hmm. they use the same material to build the house mm -hmm. but one built it on the sun mm -hmm. one built it on the rock yes sir a wind the same wind blow but the one on the rock sustain yes sir. but the one on the sun collapse yes sir are, are you listening to me there's a mystery about blood mm -hmm. How can, what is this mystery I'm talking about? Mm. Bible said, for the life of every flesh mm. is in the blood. Yes, sir. For the life is in the blood. And that blood has entered into your body. Yes, sir. Eve said, Adam, eat it. When you eat, your eye will open. Mm -hmm. Adam also took it and ate it. Mm -hmm. Who gave it to Eve? It mm -hmm. was Satan. Yeah. And anything from Satan hand is spirit of death. Yes, sir. The moment Adam ate it, mm -hmm. spirit of death entered Adam's spirit. Yes, sir. And everybody, the book of Romans chapter 5 said, by one man death comes, death came into this earth. Mm -hmm. Anything you ate from a witch doctor shrine, mm -hmm. the spirit of death enter you. Mm -hmm. So who gave you that water you drank? Mm -hmm. Who gave you that amulet you mm -hmm. swallow? Mm -hmm. Who gave you that concussion you drank? Mm -hmm. There's a mystery. Who gave you those things? Mm -hmm. You are watching me now. We just finished a radio with Apostle before we came to the studio here. Somebody just called me. I was sick when I was a child. And they took me to this witch doctor. They gave me so many things. They bathed me. Mm -hmm. And today my life is rotten. Mm -hmm. I've been in this country for 27 years. No marriage, no child, nothing. Mm -hmm. Pastor, could you pray for me? Mm -hmm. I agree and I pray for that young man. You also, I don't know where or what your fathers did for you. I don't know. When, when you were sick, did they took you to any place? Mm -hmm. What did they do for you? In fact, Jeremiah chapter 16, if you read verse 6, he said, when I passed by you and I saw that you were polluted in your own blood, mm -hmm. Your spirit man is polluted. Your system is polluted. Go to Proverbs chapter 12, verse 2. Yes, One of the things Satan does very well is what we call devices. It's mm. a mystery. Mm. If you read my book, I put it there, satanic devices. Yes, sir. All they want to do is that let their devices enter you. Mm. And the moment their devices enter you, mm. you are finished. Yeah. Are, are you there? Yes, sir. Proverbs chapter 12 yes. and verse number 2. Yes. A good man obtains favor of the a Lord. A good man obtains favor of the Lord. But a man of wicked devices. But a man of wicked devices. Will he condemn? Did you hear that? Yes, sir. What is a wicked device? A device is a tool mm. that is used to manipulate systems. Mm. A device. Yes, a device. The, see, there are certain things, a chip that is your, on your destiny. Yes, sir. You can't remove it by your hand. No. But there's a small devices. Yeah. When you buy the iPad, yeah. It's a pin. Yes, the sir. Apple people put it over yes, there. Sir. So you use it to press it. Yes, then it's, it's a device that used to open this. Yes, sir. It's a manipulative ma machinery. Uh -huh. It's a small thing, but if you don't have it, you can't remove the chip. Yeah. But the moment you have that device, you press it, the thing comes, and then you can take the change the chip yeah. or remove it. Yes, sir. It's a device. Yes, sir. So there are devices Satan has used mm. to open your spirit mm. for spirits to enter you. Mm. Poverty has no way to enter you no. except a device first enter you. Yeah. So when you were sick, where did they take you? Ah. What did your father swallow? Ah. Who was your father? Yes, sir. Was your father a hunter? Mm. Was your father a fetish priest? Mm. Was your father a warrior? Mm. The old time warrior? Mm. Was your father a chief? Mm. Who was your grandmother? Who was your mother? Was your mother a fetish priest? Was she a custodian to an altar? What did they swallow when you were sick? Where did they carry you? Uh, when you were having convulsion, when, when you were a child, when you were a baby, where did they took you? Mm. 
Most of us, Apostle, that's why we can't go forward in life. Yes, sir. Because certain wicked devices has already entered us. Yes, sir. When our mother were pregnant, mm. our mother were going through certain miscarriages. Yeah. So they must they must do something to preserve, mm. to protect and defend us. Yeah. So they took our mothers into certain shrines, yes, certain witch doctors, yes, and they give them certain things. Those yes, are the devices we are talking about. Yes, sir. It's a mystery. Mm. I put something in my book here. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. In Hosea chapter 6, verse 8, mm -hmm. he said, Gilead is a city mm -hmm. of them mm -hmm. that work iniquity mm -hmm. and is polluted with blood. Mm -hmm. It is polluted. It is what? Polluted. Polluted with blood. Go to us, chapter 20, verse 28. Yes, sir. Polluted by blood. I pray for somebody in the name of Jesus. Any devices that has entered you yes. through your blood, yes. today it is canceled. Canceled. Are you there? Ask 20 and verse number 28. Yes, sir. Take it therefore unto yourselves. Take it means be careful. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Keep going. And to all the flock, yes, over which the Holy Ghost yes. has made you overseers, yes, to feed the church of God, yes, which he has purchased with his own blood. He purchased it with his own blood. Yes, sir. The blood in the spiritual realm is a device that cover, that protects. That manipulates mm. humanity into either error of greatness. Mm. Based on the devices of the blood of Jesus, mm. God bought us mm. from satanic kingdom. Yes, sir. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. By his blood upon the altar, yes, sir. we are bold into God. Yes, sir. The confusion between me and my God is broken. Yes, sir. I have the right to go to my father God. Yes, sir. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Now, one of the devices of the blood system, mm. how Satan used the blood, mm. our blood, to defeat us. It's number one, through incision. Through incision. If they can enter into your blood, yes, sir. they can control you. Yes, sir. As I'm sitting here, my car is sitting over there. Yes, sir. If I don't give you my car key, you can't steal anything from there. Yes, sir. You can't drive the car. Yes, you can't use the car. Yes, it is locked. Yes, the key is with me. Yes, sir. If you see somebody driving the car, either I gave the, the person the key or that person broke uh, 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 into, the, the car. into the car. Yes, sir. He said, how can a strong man enter your house? Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Please, I'm praying for you by the power of the Holy Ghost. Amen. By the anointing of God. Amen. By the finger of God. Amen. Every power Amen. frustrating you. Yes, sir. It is canceled in the name canceled of Jesus. in the name of Jesus. Please, there is a telephone number on your screen. I want you to call that number quickly. 0297 I want to pray for you. Mm. One of the devices the enemy used very well, Apostle, is what? Incision. Incision. Number two, one of the devices the enemy used to enter our system, mm -hmm. to destroy us, is mm -hmm. through our dreams. Our dreams. Especially the dream that you see yourself eating. Mm. The dream that somebody is having sex with you. Mm. The dream that somebody is shooting you. Mm. The dream that somebody stabbed you. Mm. The dream that... Um, you see dogs, mm. cats, snakes mm. biting you. Mm. All they need is somebody must, something must enter you. Mm. A poison must enter you. Mm. You see a dream that somebody has injected you. Mm -hmm. You are taking tablets. Mm -hmm. See, uh, 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 Satan is the same devil. The he hasn't changed. Yes, his status is one. Yes, if you can understand his status, he cannot offend you. No. The same status. When he went to the garden, he said, Adam, eat. Mm. Eve, eat. Mm. And they ate. When he came to the garden of... Um, the place Jesus was praying, doing fasting, yes, the sir. wilderness. Yes, sir. He came there. He said, Jesus, do what? Eat. Mm -hmm. It's the same system. Yeah. If he can enter you, he's a spirit. He cannot handle you. Yes, sir. The only way Satan can hold you, disturb you, destroy you. Paul said, from henceforth. Now, go to the book of Galatians. Mm -hmm. Go to the book of Galatians. Mm -hmm. Galatians. Yes. Galatians. Yes, sir. Galatians 6, 17. Galatians chapter 6 mm -hmm. and verse number 17. Yes. From henceforth, from now on, let no man trouble let me. Let no man trouble me. For I bear in my body. For I bear inside my body the marks of the Lord Jesus. Not on your body. No. In. Inside you, yes, sir. It's a blood. Yes, sir. Inside your blood, it's a spirit. Yes, sir. Inside the spirit, it's your potential. Yes, sir. Your gift. Yes, sir. Your strength. Yes, sir. Everything that will make you great yes, is inside your spirit. Yes, sir. So, so if. You, your spirit man is marked by the blood of Jesus. Mm -hmm. No spirit can hold you. Yes, sir. That's why Jesus was going to say, take it, drink it. This, this is, is my, my blood. blood. Mm. I have to mark you. Jesus. 
Matthew. Moses took the blood and sprinkled it on them. Yes, sir. And wherever they were going, he said, pour the blood on the sprinkle. When I see the blood, I'll pass over you. Mm. I don't need to see you. I see the blood. It is the blood that mark you. Yes, sir. For either enhancement yes, sir. or destruction. Yes, sir. That's why you see, I call me quickly. Maybe you gone somewhere, they gave you incision. Uh -huh. Number two, dreams. Mm. Number three, people that has bath with concussions. Mm. They take them to the water, they bath them, they throw their clothes inside. Mm. Mm. People that has they take them to cemetery and they bath them. Mm. A lady came all the way from Luton into her church. She said that a man took her in London, mm. London into a cemetery and they bath her mm. and the man make the woman to massage mm. his manhood mm. and when the sperm came mm. they used the sperm to 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 rob this woman what are you looking for woman hey. he said I, I i was looking for marriage have you did you ever marry no hmm. <laughs> you understand what i'm saying i want to pray for you jesus there's a number on your screen call it now yes Lord. have you ever had dream that you are eating have you ever had a dream that you see animals like dogs, cats, crocodile, snakes, um, all these demonic animals chasing you? I want you to call this number quickly. Amen. I want you to call this number quickly. Amen. I want to pray for you, my yes. brother. Whatever you don't know, senior you, mm. the power of the enemy mm. operates mainly in the spiritual realm. Yes. And if you don't understand spiritual protocol, mm. And you don't understand spiritual mysteries. Yes. You walk in misery. You walk in misery. Are you listening to me? The next one that I'm talking about is very, very important. Mm. Very, very important. One of the area, the mystery I want you to know mm. that the enemy used to enter humanity is through the elements. Elements. Through the elements. Somebody can speak into the water. Yes, sir. And say, drink it. When Jesus was giving them that drink it was not his pure blood mm. i believe that it was not a red drink yeah it was the same liquid they were using to eat yeah and jesus blessed it and said drink it this is my blood physically it was not his pure blood but based on the word jesus spoke mm. into it it became jesus life yes sir and they drink it yes sir the elements so also if a satanic agent speak into this mm. The spirit of death, see, the spirit of life. He said, if you drink it, you have my life. Yes, sir. So also, if I'm a satanic agent, yes, sir. in Jesus, Romans chapter 8 verse 2 said, there's now, there's now no condemnation mm -hmm. for those who are in Christ Jesus. Jesus. For the law of the spirit of death, yes, sir. for the law of the spirit of life, yes, has set me free from the law of spirit of death. Yes, sir. So if a spirit of death, mm -hmm. a man of death, mm -hmm. a, an agent of death, yes, gave you something of death, yes, then death enter you. Death will enter you. So also, a man of life, yes, sir. an agent of the spirit of life, yes, an altar of life, yes, sir. gave you something from the altar of life. Yes, sir. Life, enter you. Amen. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. It's a short understanding. Mm. I am life. Yes, sir. You are death. Amen. So if I gave you something, yes, I gave you life. Yes, sir. So also when this one gave you something, it is what? Death. death. Yes, sir. So, so, so hear this. The things that you took they, they ask when i talk about element mm -hmm. some people they gave you some words yes sir heroscopes yes sir. and all those things yeah what is a heroscope a horoscope is things that they used from the elements yes sir they say go and recite this one seven times in every night yes sir. and something will come into your house yes sir and by the time you started renouncing reciting it reciting it reciting it a spirit will appear to you yes sir and you think that it's the spirit of god but it's not the spirit of god yes sir a satanic agent because yes, bible said satan is walking about operating through the spirit of light he yes, thinks that if you are if you are not careful uh, he, he he make himself like a spirit of light but he's not yeah many people are going through frustration frustration because they made a mistake they didn't understand mysteries mm. if you read the book of job Yes, sir. Chapter 38, mm -hmm. if you read verse 31, mm -hmm. he's talking about can you buy the Pleiades, the mm -hmm. Orion, the Mazarot, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. the ordinances of heavens. Mm -hmm. So, also, somebody will tell you, go and do this, go and do this. There's no way in the Bible they call yeah. six and seven books of Moses. No. Anything that is not from the Bible is wrong. Yes, sir. 
Are you there? Job 38. Yes. Verse number 31. 31. Verse 31. Yes, sir. Please, I want you to understand this thing. Can thou bind, can thou bind the, sweet the sweet influences of the of Pleiades? Of Pleiades. Pleiades. Yes. And, and lose, lose the, the bands of Orion. Of Orion. Can, can thou, thou can, bring yes. forth Mazaroth yes. in a season? Yes. Or can thou guide mm. Aturos? Yes, Aturos. Aturos with yes. the sons. Knowing thou the ordinances. No, no, the ordinances of yes. heaven. Did you hear that? Yes, sir. These are the elements. Elements. The clouds. Yes, sir. The lunar. Yes, sir. When somebody releases it, yes, it enter you. Yes, sir. And it begins to frustrate you. Yes, sir. Because when demonic spirits, demonic angels, they fall, yeah. some of them remain in the suns, in, yes, the, in the moon, and yes, the sir. stars, and the clouds. Yes, sir. Many, 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 many angelic, demonic angels yes, that came with Satan. Yes, sir. People think that it was all, it is only Satan, but no. it's not only Satan. No. Bible said in the book of Revelation chapter 12, yes, sir. if you read verse 3, yes, sir. the tail of Satan draw one third of heavenly stars ah, yeah. on this earth. Ah. And they were many. Ah. Ah. They are many. Ah. So Revelation chapter 12. Yes. And verse, verse number three. three. Yes, yes, sir. sir. Yes, sir. And there appeared another wonder in heaven. Yes. And behold, a great red dragon, mm -hmm. having seven heads and mm -hmm. ten horns. The great red dragon is talking about Lucifer. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. And seven crowns upon his head. Yes. And he still drew the he third still part of drew the stars the third part of heaven. Heavenly angels. So they are many. They are many. Principality. Powers, they appear right? yeah. like light. They are not light. No. No. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Please hear me. Anything they tell you, go and stand in the cemetery and recite certain things. Mm. It's wrong. Mm. Go and do this. Go and do this. They will take you to the river. Mm. They will bath you. Mm. They say, throw your clothes into mm. the water. Mm. Throw your bra, bra into your water. Mm. Throw your shirt. Throw mm. your this. Take your husband. Take, take your money and go and throw it. See, a man, a man was doing a good business in London Hill. Yes, sir. Very good business. A, a witch doctor asked him to change uh, 13 cities, the yes, whole sir. Ghana cities. Yes, sir. And, and give him a part of the Bible. Yes, sir. It looked right, but it's not right. Mm. He said, recite some 71, mm. three, seven times. Mm. Say, hey, Mary, seven times. Mm. Say in the name on the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost seven times mm. on the morning and go and throw it to the, to yes. the river teams. And the man did it. The man collapsed. He was doing very well. Successful mm. businessman mm. collapsed. See, it looked good. It looked like they are reading the Bible is good, but they are using it to confuse you. Mm. They are using it to confuse you. And that's why many people are confused. All they do is that they bring some books to you. It's a mystery. And you don't know you read that book. It yes, confuses you. Mm. I met a, a, a great woman of God here. The son was mentally derailed mm. in Homerton Hospital. Mm. I went there and I prayed for the boy. Yes, sir. And Holy Ghost said to me to go to the boy's room and I'll see something. So I asked the mom, no, the wife, and we went there. Then when I get there, God showed me where the thing is. Mm -hmm. I saw a big book, mm -hmm. horoscopes and all those things, mm -hmm. the stars and all the stargazers and all those things. I said, remove this book from here. Mm -hmm. Go and throw it away and go and burn it. Mm -hmm. Everything that represents this thing, all the thing that was showing the guy to do all those things. Mm -hmm. Then when we remove it, nobody prayed for the guy. The guy was instantly mm -hmm. healed. Instantly healed. Instantly healed. Instantly healed. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Please. What did they do for you? Ah. A young girl said this thing to me. I will never forget it. She said, there's, there's a man that the man said to, to, to her, I love you. Mm -hmm. I want to sleep with you. I'll give you. Five million naira, mm. and it was in 1999. Mm. In 1999, five million naira was a big money, yes, sir. And the man said, Take this five thousand naira, go and buy green cloth, green, 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 green stockings, everything about you green, yeah, because green turned me on, yeah. And the girl bought it, and the girl wear it. And when the girl got to the room, she said the man gave her black, 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 black. And the pants black, everything about her is black. And she removed the green. And the man slept with her. Inside, she did, she did not allow her. He did not allow her to remove the clothes. But the man slept with her on the black. And then the man said, go. And the man left. And, and, and the lady left. The man gave her all the money. But I'm telling you, after, go and see this lady. Everything the woman does, nothing prosper. Hmm. 
she did not know that somebody was changing the destiny. Mm. There are certain mysteries you must understood. Yes, sir. Are, are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Who was your first boyfriend? Mm. Who was your first girlfriend? Mm. If I'm a witch and I slept with you, yes, sir. whatever I carried, I deposited with you. Mm. Bible said, when you sleep with a man, mm. you become one with the man. Yes, sir. Your spirit man is joined together. Yes, sir. That's why they call it so tight. Yes, sir. So when the person sleeping with you is a witch, yes, sir. what are they releasing to you? Yes, sir. See, I want to show you why many people are going through what they are going through. Hmm. Yona was a great man, but I'm using it as an example. Yes, sir. When the ship was going, there was no trouble. Yes, sir. But the moment Yona entered the ship, yes, sir. there were so many ship on the water. Yes, sir. And nothing happened. Yes, sir. Bible said the moment Yona entered a particular boat, yes, sir. a contrary wind yes, blow sir. to the stairs that they remove all their goods and throw it to the water. Yes, sir. When they remove Yona and throw Yona out, the ship was calm. Ah. You understand what I'm yes, saying? Sir. So this body here, what makes this body to move? to walk, to jump, to speak. Mm. Is the spirit inside me? Yes, sir. Through the blood? Yes, sir. The moment all your blood disappears, you will sleep? Yes, sir. The moment your spirit leaves your body, you will sleep? Yes, sir. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. So, so that's why the Bible said, the young boy called Cain, ah. his body was dead. His body was buried. Abel. Abel. Yes, Abel. Sir. Abel's body died. Yes, sir. Abel's body was buried. Yes, sir. But the blood that was poured on the ground, yes, sir. Probably Cain covered the blood. Yes, sir. And everything was gone. Yes, sir. And Cain went and washed his hand. Yes, sir. Cain thought that nobody saw him. Yes, sir. But suddenly a voice appeared. Yes, sir. And God said, Cain, where is your brother? Yes, sir. He said, I don't know. I don't know. I haven't seen my brother. Maybe my brother has gone looking after his sheep. He said, Cain, don't lie to me. The blood of your brother mm. is crying from this earth against me. Yes, sir. From henceforth, the earth will catch you. Yes, sir. The elements. You understand what I'm yes, saying? Yes, sir. In Jeremiah chapter 22, verse 29, mm -hmm. he said, Oh, F, 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 hear the word of the Lord. Mm -hmm. That said the Lord, mm -hmm. record this man as childless. Mm -hmm. A man who shall not prosper in his days mm -hmm. physically. The F don't have a hand. Yes, sir. The F don't hold a pen. Are, yes, you, sir. are you there? Yes, sir. <laughs> o F. O F. 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 Hear the words of the Lord. Now, have you seen the ear of the F before? No. That you are going, then they will tell you, oh, Apostle Charles, come and see the, the, the ear of the F. Yes. Are you listening to me? Yeah. It's not there like that. No. But spiritually, there is a spiritual apparatus. Yes, sir. Computers. Yes, sir. Speakers. Yes, sir. That everything we do, yes, sir. it recorded. It's recorded. He said, hear the word of the Lord. Yes, sir. That's hear the Lord. That's hear the Lord. Yes. Write ye this man childless. Have you seen the F holding a pen before? No. But mysteriously, the F has a pen. Yes, sir. So if somebody wants to harm you, yes, sir. They take your name, yes, sir. Into a witch doctor. Yes, sir. They make incantation. Yes, sir. And they bury your name. Yes. I was in Italy. There's a place they call Parma. Mm -hmm. I met a pastor who has married. Mm -hmm. Please, those calling me. You know, call the 0207 number quickly. Call, send me only text message on this, my phone here, and let me pray with you. I know you want me to pray for you, but there is a pastor sitting now waiting for you to pray for you. Call the 0207 923 2549 and we'll connect you. Apostle. Yes, sir. They are very good people. In Parma. In Parma. In fact, they are like you. They love God. They love me. Anytime this man of God here, wherever I am, mm -hmm. he'll, wherever I am in Italy, he'll, he'll come there. Once upon a time, he drove six hours and came from all the way from Parma into Rome. Yes, sir. The man loved me so much. But they can't have a baby. Mm. They married 1999. No, they, they, yeah, they married 1996. Mm. 96, all the way up to 2006, 10 years, no mm. baby. 2007, no baby. 2008, no baby. Mm. 2009, no baby. Mm. 2010, no baby. Mm. 2011, no baby. Mm. Until 2012, mm. I went to Italy and I pray, God, please, this, this my son is a good man. He lost me, God. Everything that is hiding, tell me, I will tell them. 
suddenly i was in a trance mm -hmm. and i saw a young girl mm -hmm. about 14 years yes, sir. holding an egg mm -hmm. In a cemetery, yes, sir. and a lady was following her. Yes, sir. And the lady instructed her to hit the egg on the ground. Yes, and the girl hit it; it didn't break. The guy hit it until the egg collapsed mm. in a cemetery. Mm. And I woke up. I didn't want to forget it. Yes, sir. I took my pen and I wrote it: a girl hitting an egg on a cemetery. Mm -hmm. Why did I have that dream in your house? Mm -hmm. So the moment both they, they work in the mm. same place, yes, sir. so they came. And the moment they came from work. I didn't even allow them to rest. Mm. I just said, this is what I saw. So, my sister, have you ever lived with a witch doctor or go with a witch doctor or have they done something? He said, yes, my father's sister was a fetish priest. Uh, and when I was 14 years, yes, sir. they took a water on my head mm -hmm. with an egg. Mm -hmm. I went there. They bathed me on a cemetery mm. in our village. Mm. And they gave me an egg to strike it. And I did it about five times. And before the air collapse, mm. I said, that is your children. Mm. See, based on the elements, I, F, hear this, F recorded that yes. this woman baby through that egg has been swallowed by the egg. Uh, I also took an oil and did prophetic action. Mm -hmm. And within three years, they have three children. Mm. Most of us, they use certain things for us. They dig the ground and they bury it. Yes, sir. They dig animal, they dig the ground, bury animal. Yes, sir. A man said he took a cat. They made him to buy a cat apostle. Yes, sir. And they put a pot. You know that is saying Ghana I call yes, it that is saying yes, a, a pot, yes, iron, pot. iron pot. They put it in, on the water. Yes, and they put the cat inside it and they cover it. Mm. And he heard the cat poop, 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 until the cat died. Mm. And they used the ashes mm -hmm. of the cat, mm -hmm. cook and mix it, and she he ate it. And they buried the rest mm. on the ground. Everywhere he's going, he feels things following him. Mm. He see things in his house. Many people, they've done the same thing to you. I'm yes, talking sir. to you. Where did they take your clothes? That, did they take you to the bush and bury you before? Mm -hmm. are, are you listening to me? Yes, sir. What, some of you, some people, you are, you are watching me now. At the, in the midnight 12 o'clock, they took you to the bush. They took you to the cemetery. They took you to the river. They did something for you. I want you to call me quickly. Let Amen. me for you. God is showing me now. Why... Did they bath you only in the night? Mm. They take you to the seaside, 12 o'clock, mm. and they said, bath seven times, mm. bath eight times, mm. bath 21 times. Mm. They did it for me. Yes, sir. They took me to Accra. There's a place they call Babbage. Mm. Uh, 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 Labadi Beach. Labadi Beach, yes, sir. They said, one sponge, you know, the old sponge. Yes, sir. And there's a knitting soap. They call it a yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey. They said, you put it over there, you, you roll on the ground seven times. Yes, sir. Then you go and bath. And then you do the sponge like this, yes, and you sir. throw it on the water, mm. and you do 21 times from <laughs> 2 or 12 o'clock up to 3 o'clock. In the morning. In the morning. Why the beach? Why the beach? Why Not 21 you have a bathroom. Times? Why 21 times? Why do you do it like this and throw it mm. into the water? Mm. Who is in the water? Yes, sir. And the last thing they did for us is that as you finish everything, yes, sir. the clothes that you took, you're yes, bathing, sir. you remove it and you throw it into the river. Yes, sir. See, your Clothes carry your DNA. Mm. Your shoes carry your DNA. Mm. When the crime is committed, if we can get your clothes and your shoe, mm. they can identify who did the crime. Yes, sir. So also in the spiritual realm, it is. Yes, sir. Most of you, most of us, most of us, they say, take your money, throw it to the water. Yes, sir. In the book of Psalm 19, go mm. to Psalm 19. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Please send me your text message quickly. There's somebody you are watching me now. They took your bra, they took your pants, they throw it. Please call me on my... On the on the on the on the on the landline quickly. I want to pray for you. Are you there? Psalm 90, yes. Psalm 90, look at verse one. Verse number one. Yes. The heavens declare yes. the glory of God. The heaven is speaking. Mm. Have you seen the mouth of the heaven before? No. But they are speaking. They speak. Keep keep going. And the firmament yes. shows his handiwork. Yes. Day unto day, day, unto day utter day, speech. They utter speech. And night unto night. And night unto night. Shows knowledge. They show knowledge. They utter speech. Yes, sir. The earth speak. Yes, sir. The moon speak. Yes, sir. The stars speak. Yes, sir. All the elements speak. They speak. He said, there's no language. No there's voice. no speech or no language. Yes. Where their voice is not heard. Did you hear that? And he said, their words. Their line <laughs> is gone out through all the earth. Did you hear that? Their words to yeah. the ends of the world. Everything they speak, it's here. And they speak by your blood. Mm. They say, cut your hair. Yes, sir. They cut your hair. Take all your hair. Go and bury it. You bury it. You didn't know that you are burying your life. 
somebody you are you, you you are here jesus you are here you are I'm, I'm i'm looking at god is telling me yes sir. they took your fingernail yes sir. they took your hair yes sir for rituals ah. i want you to call me let me pray for you jesus somebody you are watching me now they use animal like a chameleon mm. like a tortoise yes sir. like a a a a a snail yes sir. they use it to do ritual for you call the number quickly i want to pray for you there's another person you are watching me now you are watching me now they took your clothes they took your clothes and and they throw it into the river they took your clothes and they bury it they took you to the bush they bath you and they bury everything that you carry you took a new thing i want you to call me let me pray for you hmm. i want you to pray hmm. I, I want to pray for you yes sir i want to pray for you please don't joke at all call the number quickly my time is up my time is up i want to pray for you I don't know what they took your fingernail for. Mm -hmm. Somebody you are watching now, they took your pubic hair. They took your pubic hair, the hair of your private part. They took it. And, and, and since then, it, it, it's, it's, it's a frustrated life you are going through. Somebody you are watching me now, they gave you something and you went and buried either your job or your house. I want you to call me quickly. I want you to call me. Somebody, you went to a place, they gave you water to wash your face. There's the word of knowledge is coming so thick and fast. They gave you water. You wash your face. Please call the number I want to pray for you. Mm. Call me quickly. They gave you somebody. You went to a place. They gave you something like a coconut mm. or a milk or whatever. Mm. And you wash your hair and your face. I want you to call me quickly. Yes, sir. There is somebody you are watching me also. They gave you or you took a money. They, 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 they make incantation or not. They asked you to go to junction. You know, four junction or three yes, junction. Sir. And you stood there and you put it over there. Mm. You put it on that junction. Mm -hmm. Coins and certain items. And you put it on that junction. Mm -hmm. and, and, and it is disturbing you. Please, I want you to, I want you to call that number quickly. 0207-923-2549. Call it now. Call it now. I want to pray for you. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Call it now. Let me pray for you. Call it now. I want to pray for you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm having so many text messages. Yes, sir. Mm. Hallelujah. Uh, somebody, I would like to leave a message for the pastor to call me uh, as I need prayer and deliverance. Many thanks. I'm supposed to stretch for my brother, Mr. Thompson. Mr. Mr. Thompson. Father, we pray for your son, Thompson. Yes, sir. We rebuke that spirit of harassment. Mm. We command there as he has declared deliverance. Mm. We release the word to deliver them. Mm. Bible says you sent your word mm. and your word healed them all. Mm. We command that deliverance to come. Mm. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you. Please pray for me concerning settlement and financial stability. Lord, I pray for my brother. His name is what? Pastor Matthew. Mm. Pastor, I pray for you in Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. Whatever the enemy is doing. In the name of Jesus. To unsettle your life. In the name of Jesus. I declare it is canceled. It's canceled. By the authority. By the authority. God has given to me. God has given to me. I release you. You are released. 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 In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. By the finger of by God. By the finger of God. Anything harassing you. Anything. It is canceled forever. Canceled. Hi, man of God. Please pray for me. My name is Curtis. Mm. I need financial fever and restoration of my health i've also prayed for father Babu says that we know the grace of our lord jesus mm -hmm. that although he was rich for our sake he became poor mm -hmm. so that through his poverty we might become rich mm -hmm. therefore based on that covenant we rebuke the spirit of poverty mm -hmm. and financial harassment we command it to leave mm -hmm. your son in jesus name mm -hmm. amen pastor my spouse is angry and violent my daughter has taken in his way the pressure is hard on me i pray for you my sister Jesus. whatever is bringing that evil to you yes i declare it is canceled canceled by the finger of god finger of by the authority in the name of jesus jesus i declare you are released amen from every curse amen you are released amen from every covenant amen in jesus name jesus name uh, not long after i married i mm -hmm. began to be sick i think my husband has given me something he gave me he gave he gave me all and i ate and drink i was so weak i could not get out of bed later i have severe pain in all my joints my husband stole my money as well life is very difficult mm. could you pray for and and father and please we pray for Anne. your daughter mm. we end the, uh, the harassment mm. we command your hand into this situation mm. Every storm that is waging mm. in her life, Hallelujah. we command peace be released in the in name Jesus of Jesus. 
Amen. Amen. I ate raw meat. Mm. Could you please pray for me? You rebuke that spirit. Yes, I can totally worship in the name of Jesus. Mm. Every demonic device that mm. has turned itself mm. into this, we mm. come against it. Release you the name of Jesus. Out the contamination in your system. Hello, Pastor. I am a lady who you spoke the word of knowledge about menstrual period that goes through that goes through it. Please pray for please pray for Michael who the, the mm. enemy has bound with alcohol. Mm. My nephew who was told he doesn't have enough blood. He was told he is anemi, an, mm. anemic. Mm. My sister who financial uh, financial going through certain things. I release you, my dear sister. In the name of Jesus. He's going to sex, sex in the dream, all those things. In the sister name of Agnes, Jesus. Agnes, I pray for you. In the name of Anything Jesus. Anything harassing you, I in declare the name it of is cancelled. Amen. By the authority in the name of Jesus. Authority in the name I of Jesus. I pray for you. Yes. Any covenant against you and your family. Amen. Demonic covenant. Any misery you are going through, Amen. I declare an end forever. An end. Dear pastor, please kindly support me in prayer to have a, what is this? Holistic, holistic, holistic health, health and divine breakthrough mm. as well as my family. Mm. Please pray in agreement mm. uh, with me that mm. God will turn mm. my father's life around mm. from the spirit of unforgiveness. Mm. I also pray for my sister. Father, we pray for this daughter of yours. Bible says in the book of 3 John 2, mm. you wish above all things that we prosper yes, and sir. be in health yes, sir. as our soul prospers. We pray that mm. that word will fulfill mm. in the life of your daughter. Mm. We pray for the father's salvation. We pray mm. the, blood the blood for this man. Ah, that that the spirit pray. of anger and unforgiveness will disappear. Mm. And that the spirit of forgiveness will take control. Mm. In Jesus' name. Pastor, Amen. please pray for me. I dream about snakes. Uh -huh. My name is B-E-R-I. Berlin. 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 Mm. Berlin. Berlin. I pray for you, my dear. We cast that spirit. Whether you're a man or you're a woman. We cast you are free in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the serpentine spirit. We cast it. Holy Ghost fire. We cast it. Locate them. Locate. Destroy them. Destroy. The God. Yes. Our God is yes. a consuming fire. Amen. Destroy them. Amen. Hallelujah. Hi, Pastor. Please pray for me uh, and my family. There's a lot of negative energy and arrow being sent against us. We are losing all we are losing all we have worked for and had been constant in bad luck mm. and bad news mm. thank god Car caroline mm. god bless you pastor pray for me i'm i'm sitting watching you your show there is a block on my family sources and everything i pray sister Caroline, in the name of Jesus, may God release you. Release. May God bless you. Bless you. May God empower you. Empower you. Anything that frustrates your life, yes, it is broken. Broken. In Jesus uh, name. Pastor, nice watching you. I've been waiting for this day mm. uh, for you to pray for me. Mm. I've been tortured with constant pressure mm. of working mm. and always spending money mm. back to fix my car. Mm. Uh, my car. Taxi problem always. Mm. Uh, taking out my effort. Having my elder sister who is married but never had a child. Uh, some not yet married. Mother always getting attacked. Mm. I have also pray for my sister, please. Father, we pray for uh, this harassment that uh, beguiled your, your daughter. We mm. command it to cease. Ah. We command it to end. We rebuke the hands of the enemy. Satan, we curse you. Mm. Lose your hold and your grip. Mm. In Jesus, Jesus name. name. Hallelujah. Please pray for Rosemary who experienced bad dreams and wake up two to three times a night and is fearful. Please, please pray. I pray for you, Rosemary. In the name of Jesus. Anything that is attacking you in your dream. In the name of Jesus. I release you in the name you of are Jesus. Released. No weapon against you. Pastor. No weapon. May God bless you. God bless in you. Jesus name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Please pray for me. My life is under under barren case. Mm -hmm. I cannot meet a good man. Mm. My department is, my department in university has been, been shut down. Mm -hmm. I have not been able to earn money since 2012. Mm -hmm. My father died in 2015. Mm -hmm. My brother is violent and dangerous. Mm -hmm. My sister is involved in the occult. Mm -hmm. I suffer terrible from rejection and jealousy. Mm -hmm. I do not know how to have a breakthrough. Mm -hmm. Please pray for 
pray for me. Mm -hmm. I now have now allergies, have allergies mm -hmm. with most food. Mm -hmm. I am working very hard mm -hmm. and cannot make money mm -hmm. at graphic design. Mm -hmm. I feel isolated. Mm -hmm. Please pray for me. Mm -hmm. Johanna. Johanna. Johanna, I pray for you. Yes, sir. You are a good woman. You are a quality woman. Anything that is frustrating, Johanna, it is cancelled. Cancelled? By the power of the Holy Ghost. Power. Johanna, you are free. Free. Any harassment attack you, it is cancelled. Amen. 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 Did, did you hear this? Yes, sir. If you are not here and yes, I'm sir. reading, yes, somebody may say things yes, that maybe this man yes, is exaggerating. Yes, sir. Hello, Pastor. I'm watching you on the TV and I see you. I see you TV and I see you on, on the uh, I see you. Yeah. I am asking you if you can pray for my husband, his papers in the home office. Please, Pastor, pray for me. I'm supposed to pray for Father this by your me. mercy and your goodness and grace. We intervene for your daughter. We command the documents to be released. Be released now. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Uh, in a dream, a man raped me with his finger whilst I was trying to protect someone else. But the other person seems to be to be me. Mm -hmm. Can you please pray for me? I did not recognize the man. Mm -hmm. Thank and I pray for you. Any spirit that has programmed rape. to harass you, mm -hmm. to torment you, mm -hmm. rape is a tormenting spirit. They command. I destroy them. Yes. Holy Ghost fire. Now destroy them. Destroy them. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Let me read the last one. Um, uh, there's someone that send this one here and i want to yeah i always dream i am in my village mm -hmm. that's a spirit of setback yes sir i'm supposed to rebuke that spirit from my we command the hand of god mm -hmm. and by the authority of the word which is the spiritual sword mm -hmm. we cut it off mm -hmm. we set you free mm -hmm. in the name of jesus mm -hmm. and every covenant will revoke it mm -hmm. by the power of the holy ghost mm -hmm. in jesus name somebody Amen. somebody just sent a text message saw a small boy a young boy of about 10 to 12 years old uh, sleeping with her is is it's not a good dream no it's not a good dream it is counseling jesus name. jesus name. that spirit that has married using a small boy face mm. to abuse you yes. it is cursing jesus yes amen amen listen to me my name is pastor jones daddy boy my number is on your tv now i'm seeing it now zero seven nine zero seven nine five zero seven zero one eight five three please i want you to call me and i want to pray for you um I, I, the moment i go off on the tv call me on the mobile phone we can stop. Look at what people are sending. Apostle, mm. how can somebody mm. use a small boy face mm. to come and sleep with her? Mm. You can see it on and on mm. and on and on mm. and on and mm. on and on and on. Look at this one. Please pray for my daughter. Demonic attack. You see? Demonic attack. Mm. You see? Demonic attack. Mm. Please, I want you to call me. Nothing destroy a man when you are ignorant. Mm. There are certain mysteries I want to show to you. Amen. Don't sit down and die. There's yeah. hope for you. Yes. I want to talk with you. Yes. I want to bless you. Yes. I want to speak with you. Yes. Please don't sit down and die. Mm. Don't don't live a frustrate a frustrated life. Yes. Please hear me. Every Tuesdays, every Wednesdays, yes. every Fridays, yes. I sit down and I talk one to one yes. to people from five from four o'clock. Find time and come. Let us talk together. Yes, sir. And I pray from this my book. Please, I want to send it to you. And to add another book to it, mm -hmm. I will add this one to a breaking evil cycle and the power of the altars mm -hmm. and the manifestation of curses. Mm -hmm. If you can give us 20 pounds or more, mm -hmm. if you make a check, make it payable to deliverance outreach ministry. Yes. I urge you, let something touch your heart. These people have been talking to me every day. We are praying for people. Oh, Apostle, we are just here now. Yes, Within sir. the short time, we have 889 test messages. Mm. Within one hour. Mm. That's how desperate people are. Mm. Because this TV go all over to Africa. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. The whole world. People are watching through uh, the, the, the sky, through the internet, everywhere. Yes, so I want you to be part of this program. Amen. We want to come every day three times. Amen. We want to build, build our own TV. Amen. Let something touch your heart. Amen. Send a sacrifice. Amen. And God will bless you. Amen. Amen. Apostle, Amen. you want to say something quick before Yes, we uh, precious viewers, thank you so much for your time. And thank you for tuning in. This is a timely message for you. Yes, sir. Those of you who called and requested for, I, I, was, I was, my heart, anytime we reset it, yes, Apostle sir. and I, yes, our heart are attached. Please. 
God has God, God, God is even more tearful mm. when he, he sees you suffering like mm. this. Mm. And God wants you to come out of that. Mm. That's why God has anointed his servant and given the grace for mm. deliverance. Mm. I keep telling you that mm. if your case is a spiritual covenant mm. that has been uh, uh, enacted through your ancestors mm. or any way, mm. prayer of petition will not get you the answer. Mm. You can fast, you can do it, it, it will not go. Mm. You need deliverance. Mm. So please, find time mm. and come. Mm. When we pray for you like this, we, we, sub, we subdue the, the, the harassment. Mm. But we want to talk to you and approve it mm. out of your life once mm. and for all. Mm. Talk to you and Please, it. we want to deal Uproot with it, it. Mm. so that you be free. We God want you to be free. God wants you to be free. Mm. Let this year be your year. Yes, sir. God bless you. God bless you. Apostle, please give your number before we go. My yeah. number is 078 078-32-35-09-09. 54 54 repeat it 078 yes sir 32 yes sir 35 yes sir 09 yes sir 54 and don't forget we just came from israel um we'll be going again in may 2017 yeah. so please if you want to come with us the may one is not pilgrimage the may one is it's a prayer. prophetic prayer we're going to pray and last last um the one that we went we did we we, we we're trying to check something we want to we want to walk mm -hmm. we want to walk um all over jerusalem walls mm -hmm. and i call it prophetic praying uh -huh. through the walls of jerusalem uh -huh. and we want to do, do that thing but we we we, we try and, and, and see certain things mm -hmm. so when we're there this time we we took a uh, four it, it, it have 12 gates yes sir so we did four gates if you see you see me and the people over there we were walking we we're walking we walk the the, the 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 first gate second gate is about all the gates are about seven miles mm -hmm. but we're able to do about four miles mm -hmm. hallelujah and may god bless you so if you want to come with me come and it's a prophetic prayer please uh, those people that are calling me wait for me one minute i'm going to finish and god will bless you may god bless you May God empower you. Amen. May God lift you on high. Amen. Myself and Apostle, Apostle Charles said, God bless you. God bless you. Your life will never be the same again. Amen. You are blessed. You are blessed. In Jesus' name. Amen. Don't, don't forget to call me. My number is 07950 yes. 701853. Yes. May God bless you. Bless you. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Bye-bye. 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 Bye-bye.